Hey guys, what's going on? I <laughs> Yeah, so I made some tall swords as big as I could make them. And first I'll show you some overproduced gorgeous cinematics and then I'll give you time lapse of me actually building the stuff. So enjoy some giant fantasy swords. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, just for reference, I wanted to show you the size that I normally build my swords, but I wanted some more detail, so I needed something larger. So I went to this size. I wasn't sure how big to make it, so I went with this and started putting in some detail just so that I would know if this was the right size. I wasn't really finding anything that was similar to this, uh, so I didn't really have anything to go by, so I just started messing around. And then at about this point, I realized it's not big enough, so I thought, just how big can I go? Well, to the very top. I went as high as I could in 1.16, which is, I believe, 256 blocks. So the top of that hilt there is uh, at the very top of the world. So here I'm just making the basic shape of a sword. And uh, once I'm happy with the general layout, I'll start defining an actual shape of a sword. And then I'm gonna use this basic setup for all the swords that I'm making today. Starting with what I've been calling the spider sword, just because of the shape that's going to be forming here in the middle, the cross guard area. Now I've got a lot of experimenting to do because I've never done anything, uh, at least uh, never a weapon on this scale, and it's kind of new, so I just have to try all sorts of things out. You're going to see a lot of shifting and changing, but ultimately I'll get there. And you know, I didn't set this up like a proper build challenge, but uh, let me know if you have a favorite. Uh, I kind of like them all for different reasons. I try to make them as different as possible. But let me know what you think. I'm going to go ahead and speed this along. I'll speed it up so you can watch the time lapse. Please enjoy. Enjoy. 